never felt pressure to do anything against my belief here. You can be free to live out your faith. It's, it's really open and welcoming. Because I'm new here, it's easy to find new friends. The students are really close. It's really fun. When you walk down the halls here, you just feel more at home. The teachers challenge me every day. The grading skill is, is hard, so we have to work. You just get to use a lot of your brain. I think it's fun to learn about Jesus. I believe that everything we do is impacted by our beliefs. And I don't believe that uh, education is immune from that. Every teaching, every teacher, every education comes from a certain point of view. That's inescapable. This education that we provide here, what I do in the classroom, my job as an administrator, it all flows out of my Christian worldview. You walk in the door and you know that it's different. You know it's not another public school. You know it's not even another Christian school. But like, um, especially the retreat we have every year really brings the student body close. There's just so much freedom in a private school where we can teach about Jesus. And I appreciate, I guess, how we can relate everything to how Jesus would do that. We're not just trying to escape the bad world out there. We're really trying to uh, send our kids off to make a difference in the world. CMCS truly lives out their mission that they are going to, everything is Christ-centered and that, that's the difference. You can go into a classroom and learn math and science or you can come here and learn all of that from a biblical perspective. There's just no comparison. I like science because it's really interesting to learn about God's Word. We also get the Christian perspective on it too because it just it like strengthens your faith as well as your knowledge. When you learn about God in math, when you learn about God in science, I think it really just helps you remember it more. My biggest goal would be for them to know that Jesus loves them and that they are special. You don't see the kids all always depressed and looking down. I mean, the people look happy. They look like there's something about them. Lots of students that will come and um, ask me personal things, personal questions, and, and through, through those meetings with students, I point them, try to point them to Christ as well. I think the teachers are really nice. Like, you can go to them for anything, not just schoolwork, but, you know, personal things spiritual things and you can go and laugh and tease with them too. We know so much about them and where they're coming from because we know their parents too. I really do believe that our teachers care. They want to make a difference. Uh, I, they share my values so when I'm sending my kids to school I'm not really wondering what kind of values uh, they're teaching. They're the same as mine are. That our children when they go to school are going to be taught uh, from that same perspective uh, that we would teach them. Well, I'd have to say that parenting is probably the most difficult thing I've ever done in my life. And so I look at Central as being a team player. And I think that's one of the strengths of, of Central Minnesota Christian School is the fact that we got parents and community heavily involved and it, it really has a, a kind of a big family feeling to it. Like we have relationships with our teachers and I don't know if all schools have that. We see the teachers as an extension of us. The teachers are really nice. Mrs. Soul is really nice and she's funny. I love my job. I, I go home, I love it, on my way to work, I don't dread coming here. I appreciate the teachers and the staff because they live what they say. It's not just something that they do from 8 to 3, Monday through Friday. It's the way they do their life. How can a student possibly come to Jesus Christ if they can't see passion of Christ within me? So that is why I wake up every day and I say, Lord, please help me to be a light so that they can see Christ living in me. Because God is here and God is in our school and in everyone's hearts, it's just something about them that you, you can see and you can notice it's different. I think God's definitely involved there with, with chapels and small groups and praise and worship time before school. You have to have them in a place like this to really truly appreciate the difference that Christian education can make. And if CMCS were not here, there would still be Christian education happening in people's homes. But parents came here and established Central Minnesota Christian School to help them in carrying out Christian education. I tell them almost daily, now take this 
and go be excellent out in the world in whatever you do because I really feel that God calls us to be excellent.